Hey people, this is a video response to Retri's uh, how to get what you want video. <coughs> With respect to the hobby, I think that definitely the desire to improve is the most important aspect. When, um, when you see people on forums and on YouTube channels commenting on, oh I can't get the same results and how do you do it like that? You must have some awesome skill. Uh, don't get me wrong, I've only been in this hobby one and a half years now, something like that. And for I've learned loads in the past one and a half years. I started off with a Raven Guard army and with no terrain. I used the Assault on Black Reach set and took the Space Marines and painted the Space Marines up as Raven Guard and then about I don't know about half a year ago I realized as I improved that my first models that I originally painted and thought were uh, really nice uh, weren't as good as my current standard uh, of painting. I'd improved enough that I didn't feel my army looked like one army, like it had all been painted by the same painter. Because the difference between my first painting and my most recent stuff was so different. Um, and that improvement only came by practice. Everybody knows the phrase, practice makes perfect. But recently, in the past half a year or so, after I stripped my army and um, like completely repainted it with different chapter colours um, I tried to branch off into rather than Raven Guard which is black, black and white I started a new chapter called the Forest Brethren and they are, they are green, uh, grey and light brown fairly good colour scheme but using that different colour scheme I was able to explore a lot of def different techniques explore how to do colour, how to um, layer my colours and uh, do a lot of more, more blending and freehanding uh, work it was only by experimenting and like pushing uh, the boundaries of what I was comfortable with that made me uh, improve into how good I am today. Don't get me wrong, I'm not the best uh, painter, I'm not the best uh, terrain builder or whatever, but I still feel that I can teach someone um, who may not be as good as me or someone who may be better than me or equally as good that may have a different technique and I might be able to through my YouTube channel and my interaction on the forums I might be able to contribute to the community and teach other people to better their own um, hobbying yeah so um, on the subject of improvement um, a lot of hobbyists out there are younger um, people, like young people, um, a lot of them will get frustrated by the fact that their work isn't as good as what they're seeing in White Dwarf, what they're seeing painted by Heavy Metal Team, um, but that's okay, that desire to improve um, is the first step on in actually improving yourself, you've got to want to improve your work, you've got to see how you think it could be better uh, to be able to improve it in the first place, otherwise you're just going to stay with the same techniques using the same style of painting uh, or terrain building or whatever um, and you're just going to stay at the same like level. Um, what I would say to younger hobbyists is that don't worry um, if you're in this hobby for the long run, good on you. But um, uh, a lot of skills I found have come with um, time. 
I originally started playing um, uh, Warhammer Lord of the Rings when I was 12. I really didn't understand the hobby then. And I started off painting this like uh, Minas Tirith armor is Bolgar metal and the face is pink and all the leather bits are brown. There we go, done. Put it on the table and played with it, but um, I've grown from uh, um, up to where I am now. I'm 19 years old. Uh, I, I took a big long break from playing and because I got bored of it, I did, really didn't understand the game. But now that I'm 19, I've improved because I now have a better eye for detail. I now have much better skills for improving my work. Yeah, um, for all the hobbyists out there, the only way you're going to improve is by pushing your boundaries, really. Is by going over, trying a new technique, not being so good at it, and then trying over and over again.